Hi, I'm Michael and I wrote City Trees. I'm here in Brooklyn, New York, uh, but I grew up and went to college in Arizona. When I turned 25, I had a little bit of a breakdown and decided I needed to get out of there. I think I just hadn't really had much adventure in my life yet, so I packed my things, I said goodbye to my parents, my friends, and my really cheap rent, and got on a plane. And when I got to the city, I really only knew one person. I had one friend and one colleague, and my girlfriend at the time had accepted a fellowship down in Haiti, so I was feeling especially alone. And on top of that, I had work to do. I had a commission from the Gay and Lesbian Band Association to write a celebratory piece. Needless to say, I was struggling quite a bit with writing that piece. So whenever I would get uh, about a writer's block, uh, I would take a walk. And so I would take walks in my neighborhood, and I began to notice the trees uh, that line the city blocks, and I sort of started to become obsessed with them. Not because they were trees, I mean, I've seen trees before, but uh, because each one of them just seems to be sort of like imprisoned or like shackled in a way. Most of them live in a plot of dirt really no bigger than like a welcome mat or like a conductor's podium or something like that. And yet, over the years, so many of them have become so big and so strong that they've actually like buckled and cracked through the concrete. There's an obvious metaphor here and once I realized it, it became really comforting me to see how these trees had flourished in such a challenging environment. For me, City Trees is a reflection of the bravery that it takes to venture into new worlds, embrace other cultures, and lovingly encourage new ideas. I'm especially honored to dedicate this piece to the Gay and Lesbian Band Association, and although I may never completely understand the challenges that my friends have had to face and overcome, I am incredibly inspired by the amount of courage that had so firmly planted that continues to grow, albeit slow, but always stronger. So with that said, thank you for listening and please enjoy City Trees.